In this exercise, we're going to divide polynomials. We'll divide 4x to the 4th plus 3x cubed minus 5x minus 2 by x squared plus 1. We check first to see if they are in descending order, and both the dividend and the divisor are. And then we check the dividend to see if there are any missing terms. There is a term with a degree 4, term with degree 3, but no term with degree 2, no x squared term. So when I write that in the problem, I'm going to take x squared plus 1 into this polynomial. I'm going to write a 0x squared. So I have 4x to the 4th plus 3x cubed plus 0x squared minus 5x minus 2. And that is there in case I need, a, need to subtract from an x squared term. I begin by taking 4x to the 4th and dividing it by x squared, or thinking what times x squared is 4x to the 4th. And that answer would be 4x squared. Then I multiply 4x squared times the entire divisor, and I get 4x to the 4th plus 4x squared. And I want to line up the 4x squared under my x squared term. And now I can subtract. 4x to the 4th minus 4x to the 4th is 0. 3x cubed minus 0 is 3x cubed. 0x squared minus 4x squared is minus 4x squared. Now I think x squared times what is 3x cubed? Well, that's going to be 3x. So I multiply 3x times x squared plus 1, which is 3x cubed plus 3x. I want to line that up under my negative 5x. And if I want to, I can bring that down if you want to see that more clearly. When I subtract, 3x cubed minus 3x cubed is 0. Negative 4x squared minus 0 is negative 4x squared. Negative 5x minus 3x is minus 8x. Now I divide again. Negative 4x squared divided by x squared is negative 4. I write a minus 4 in the quotient. And I multiply negative 4 times x squared plus 1. That gives me negative 4x squared minus 4. I line that up under my constant term, and I can bring down that constant term if I want to. And I subtract. Negative 4x squared minus negative 4x squared is 0. Negative 8x minus 0 is negative 8x. Negative 2 minus negative 4 is plus 2. Now, how do I know when to finish? Well, my divisor has degree 2. I now have a remainder here of degree 1. When the degree of the remainder is less than the degree of the divisor as it is here, I can finish divide, dividing. My answer will be the quotient with this as a remainder, which I can write as 4x squared plus 3x minus 4 with a remainder of negative 8x plus 2. Or I can write it as the, this quotient plus the remainder divided by the divisor. So I can also write this as 4x squared plus 3x minus 4 plus negative 8x plus 2 divided by the divisor, which was x squared plus 1. Both of these are acceptable ways of writing the answer to this division problem.